I'd like them a bit better than that. Oh, don't don't shoot at me. How rude. Let me shoot at you. This is going to hurt. Yeah, it did too. G'day mate, how you doing? Uh, it's great to have your company, thanks for dropping by. Fern be with you, and we're back into World of Warships. Thought we'd rock out a couple of games in the Cleveland, haven't dragged her out for a little while, when we've just been playing uh, World of Warplanes uh, for a little while. Thought we'd get back on the water, and uh, as I said, uh, try out the Cleveland. But before we do that, here's a short message from our sponsors. Are you looking for a mature and committed gaming community to share your passion with? And 87 may just be what you're looking for. Boasting members from all over the world, all being able to enjoy a wide range of online games, from Battlefield 1 to Stellaris, World of Warships to World of Warcraft. So for all your gaming passions, remember 87. Links in the description below, and for all T's and C's, refer to the Code of Conduct on the forum's webpage. And now, back to my game. Okay, now that uh, that unpleasantry is out of the way, let's get into battle with the Cleveland. Don't mind the Cleveland. Um, tends to be my go-to ship for some reason. Uh, look, I, these days I play anything from one to one to nine. I actually had a, um, a tier ten battle the other day, which was always fun and dandy. But that was one of those high ships on the on the clan battles. But uh, look, anything from one to nine. Um, but uh, yeah, I tend to go back to the Cleveland. Wyoming, Kamikaze, just for bits and giggles, and then uh, you know you go and go to lower ranks and that for, for some silk clubbing, so which is always which is always fun. Now you just heard an ad from the '87 Clan uh, gaming community. Been involved with quite a number of years now. The good guys over there. They were good. Um, look, you'd be hard pressed to find a game that uh, that they don't play. Uh, with you know, no matter what what you play. Uh, any online games, uh, if we don't have a channel set up for it already, we can set one up for you. So go and check us out, ag7.com, as, as we mentioned in the ad. And um, yeah, jump into TeamSpeak, jump into Discord, and uh, hang out. Okay, we are now on the water. Let's see what sort of teams we have up against. Generally, fives and sixes, which looks like an evenly matched game, to be honest. Um, no carriers, which is a bit disappointing when you're rocking the Cleveland, but hey, when you're rocking the Cleveland, we'll just set fire to shit. Uh, hi team, where to? And it's always good to start off with something like that just to start the communication. Excuse me while I sip my coffee. Uh, he wants to go over at A, that's a fair call. We'll uh, go as quickly as we can in the Cleveland and support some of these DDs with our HE. So what have you been up to lately? Um, you've been keeping well, hopefully. And talking about the clan that uh, we've not long come back uh, from PAX Melbourne. What an awesome experience that was. If, if you haven't been to a, uh, a convention like that, then I would strongly recommend that you you uh, sort of concentrate on the game here that you start putting your coins aside and save up for it uh, for next year so they seem to that's the second one I've been to and they seem to be able to outdo themselves every year so it's uh, certainly bigger brighter and better this year than it was last year um, look whether it was because of the packs or whether we were able to get a half decent nice sleep because we weren't uh, look the backpackers was, was okay last year you know live and learn but it was just a little bit more comfortable this year uh, with the accommodation that we stayed at. Again, not that we stayed much at the accommodation. We're, if we weren't at if we weren't at PAX, we we're out um, drinking, basically. Let's let's call a spade a spade. We, we were drinking, and uh, yes, some more than others. I'm not pointing fingers, but um, we had a good time nonetheless. And uh, yeah, uh, GG Easy. We went and hung out there for quite a while. Um, 
Wargaming had a little bit of a get together on uh, at uh, GG Easy on the Thursday night, which was pretty awesome. Let's just swing over here and say, see if we can't get some rounds on that DD. I'm gonna watch out. I'm gonna watch out for this other Cleveland over here. Let's get some rounds. No, we're not gonna get him detected. Yes, we are. That's the thing about this Cleveland, these rounds just hit sub orbit, don't they? A nice little fire happening on that though. Cleveland over there. I'm a little bit broadside to those ships out the north there, so I'm gonna have to have a quick left hand turn just to keep out of their reach. And I thought those rounds might be coming in for me, they're not. Awesome. Which way you go, Sunshine? Well, let's put some rounds out here just to Tickle your butthole and make sure that you don't come back. Should drop off detectability. There we go. Dropped off detectability. Let's whack that up. I mean, they'd have plenty of eyes and ears out there anyway, so. Yeah, defensive AA is a bit of a waste, to be honest, but look, could have used them as a spotting aircraft. Probably really need to be up for it a little bit more than I am now, to be honest, to be to be effective. Always a fine line, I think, between uh, pushing forward and, and being effective, and and going too far forward and getting your butt kicked. Fire on the enemy yep, I would if I could reach him. Power. Uh, let's just give it a, give that a whirl. Okay. I get some rounds out there. To... Again, rounds just hitting sub or but. You really gotta guess where he's going to be in there, uh, you know. Yeah, swing and a miss. Really gonna guess where he is, uh, where he's going to be in in uh, in ten minutes' time. The enemy team has taken the lead. That may miss him, as it did. Okay, so we've got an Iron Duke over here. I wonder if he's pre wonder if he's going to press in. If he decides to press in. Although this broadside, um, whatever this is over here, might be worth a couple of shots at. They look good. Oh, I'd like them a bit better than that. Oh, don't don't shoot at me. How rude! Let me shoot at you. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, it did too. That little bastard. Right, I'm gonna burn you down, sunshine. Let's get this iron juke burning. Just sneaking behind the rock there, but we should be able to clear that rock and get him getting burning from tip to toe. Where's those whoops coming from? Nothing. 17 seconds, so time to get out of dodge. <clears throat> oh, this is going to be a paddling. If that Iron Duke's got his guns on point, oh, I'm going to beat you, absolute dickhead. Yeah, this is going to hurt. This is really going to hurt.
Oh, give me some fires already. No fires? Well. Wow. Oh, come on already. This is really gonna hurt. Got a base uh, cat uh, reset, rather, but. Jamie, those fires. Yay. That time, too. It's, it's only taken me all my health to get that fire blazing on him and they can smell blood all right they can smell blood some of those may get over that hill just scrape over the hill do we get another fire no one round i mean i'm gonna be out of this game and you gotta watch out for the border there power not a terribly successful game to be honest um oh someone just deleted him excellent 112 hp this is ridiculous certainly not my best cleveland game i'll give you the big tip time to go and hide somewhere i think he's out of my range no let's just pop some rounds over the top Get the skids. And try to, uh, to stay alive on 112 HP. Wow. <coughs> Can't reach him. And he's not being detected anymore. Where's that Cleveland? He's running away, question mark. Could be detected reasonably soon. No, there's not much I can do, as I said, with 112 HP. So it's just a matter of sitting here and being quiet. They're not going to get over that hill, are they? No. Scaring the villagers again. All stations requesting fire on the enemy is about to win. Best I can do is just pop rounds out and I hope it might hit something. Kill the battleships, yeah, good on your power. How am I going to kill the battleships? They're just going to sneeze on me and I'll, I'll go down. Be far better to um, just to sit back and rain HE from a distance. Yeah, they've well and truly got this match wound up. Unless we take a couple of ships out very, very quickly. They've certainly got this match well and truly in the bag. As I said, they only got a sneeze on me and I am toast.
Up, 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 up. Oh, that was close. Well, at least we survived the match. Didn't do anything uh, terribly exciting, but look, you get games like that. Guys, thank you very, very, very much for your company. Certainly do appreciate it. And I'll look forward to it in the next one.